Hello friends. In this video, we are going to learn one of the important tools in the analyze phase of Lean Six Sigma, to investigate the variation in your data, that is, multivari charts, with the help of practical examples for easy understanding and better clarity. So, let's begin. Multivari chart. The multivari chart is used as a preliminary tool, to investigate variation in your data, including cyclical variations and interactions between factors. A multivari chart provides a graphical representation of the relationships between factors and a response. The multivari chart displays the means at each factor level, for every factor. In Minitab, each multivari chart can display up to four factors. For example, an engineer wants to assess the effect of sintering time on the compressive strength of three different metals. The engineer measures the compressive strength of three specimens of each metal type at each sintering time, 100 minutes, 150 minutes, and 200 minutes. Then, the engineer creates a multivari chart to look for possible trends and interactions in the data. Data considerations for multivari chart. To ensure that your results are valid, consider the following guidelines when you collect data, perform the analysis, and interpret your results. 1. The response should be numeric. To calculate the mean response at different factor levels, the multivari chart requires numeric response data. 2. Each factor should have at least two levels. You may have up to four numeric, text, or date and time factors. Each factor must have at least two levels. 3. You must have observations for enough factor level combinations. You need observations for at least 60% of all possible factor level combinations, for Minitab to create the chart. Suppose you are studying two factors, A and B. Factor A has three levels, and factor B has two levels. There are six possible combinations of factor levels or cells in this design. If data are not included for one of these combinations, it creates an empty cell, indicated by star in the cell. In this example, if three of the six factor level combinations do not have observations, then Minitab cannot create a multivari chart. Example of multivari chart, let's continue with the same example we had seen in the introduction. An engineer wants to assess the effect of sintering time, on the compressive strength of three different metals. The engineer measures the compressive strength of three specimens of each metal type, at each sintering time, 100 minutes, 150 minutes, and 200 minutes. The engineer creates a multivari chart to look for possible trends, and interactions in the data. Please follow the procedure to get multivari chart in Minitab. 1. Enter or copy the data in Minitab worksheet. 2. Select Stat, Quality Tools, Multivari Chart. 3. In Response, Enter Strength. 4. In Factor 1, Enter Center Time. 5. In Factor 2, Enter Metal Type. 6. In Options, Enter the title for chart as, Multivari Chart for Strength, and. 7. Click OK. Interpretation of Results. The multivari chart indicates a possible interaction between the type of metal and the length of sintering time. The greatest compressive strength for metal type 1 is obtained by sintering for 100 minutes, for metal type 2 by sintering for 150 minutes, and for metal type 3 by sintering for 200 minutes. The data show that the strength varies differently across sintering times for different metal types, indicating an interaction. To quantify this interaction, and to determine whether it is statistically significant, the engineer could further analyze this data with an ANOVA, that is analysis of variance, or a general linear model. For references, we have taken some part of this detailed content from Minitab. Now to end, please like this video if you have found it useful, add your valuable comments, and share this video with your friend and colleagues, to improve and refresh their knowledge. If you want to get updates of such videos from our channel, please do not forget to subscribe to it, click on the bell icon, and select to get all notifications. And finally, thank you for watching.